How's the mag out? It's a women's website. You could argue that it's normalising. Personally, I don't look to magazine covers for realism. That's what public pools are for. It's doing really well. We're two months behind in rent and you go and hire a new writer. So what are we pitching? Baby led weaning. Podcasting. Celebration of the slut. The men's column. Can flavoured yoghurt treat thrush? That's a yes from me. Anything else? What about the golf oil spill? An article I wrote went viral and I'm just so overcome. It was about the end of my marriage and the trauma of women. I just could not be happier. I've got to go. I don't know why you're being so argumentative. I was perfectly happy being unhappily married. I'm assuming that you've read the comments. No, I don't read the Evelyn comments. Evelyn Jones co-opted feminism, profiteering off her beautiful face. That's nice. Her and her privilege. Just stop at beautiful face, Peter. Mothering can be really boring. <laughs> I mean... Just less is more. In your case, less and less is more. What's happened? I I'm just trying to tell it as it is. And you're just profiting from anxiety. The words, they, they just pile on and pile on until you're suffocated. I'm wondering what it's all for. The work, the, the criticism, the disappointment. Not in a midlife crisis kind of way, because that'd be boring. In a, in a more intelligent, existential way. Everything I am, everything I have is wrapped up in this website. You need to face your fears, my friend. Jake, could you please tell me when it's 4.30? It's 12 past 5.